Hi the magpie! Or actually, I should say... Hi the magpie! <laughs> Welcome! To the video manual for this, which is... The lo-fi phone. This video is gonna be a bit more chaotic than all of the other uh, video manuals so far because Space Master Andreas visited here and uh, we jumped straight into playing around with a lo-fi phone and I just recorded him into the DAW to like start a project that we might work on in the future. So that was a really fun experimentation time for us bonding. Well, yeah, I really felt like I, I had to do this intro first to talk a little bit about it, show some stuff and uh, actually speak into it because I don't think we did vocals at all. So yeah, this is how it sounds. It's an old telephone. They actually started making it in the 50s, I think, in the late 50s. So it's very, very vintage. And it sounds like this. And what I've done is uh, since I make the stutter phones, which is a guitar pedal. A guitar pedal that I make out of the rotary piece from these old vintage phones. I didn't want to discard like the rest of the phone. That would be dumb. So I decided to turn them into microphones and I'm using what you used to listen with for the kids out there that never had to deal with rotary phones. This was the earpiece and down here you talked. <laughs> but down here where you talk, I've now put a big knob. And that knob is an active volume boost knob because it's very low volume actually in these. So that's all that is. And it's very nice because uh, when you turn it off, you can sort of hear a bit of a hum. Now you can get rid of that hum and just turn it all the way down instead. And you don't have to deal with that. Works on a 9 volt battery and I'm gonna show you that also. I have 3D printed these bottom plates and then coated them with a rubber color that I found for cars, which is kind of dope. But yeah, there are screws behind sort of the feet. I put like furniture paws, fabric-y, very cozy. And then there's a screw there, so if you unscrew those screws, I have one here, you can see there's a 9 volt battery in there. And you can replace yourself. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very convenient. I actually shipped them with a 9 volt battery just for the convenience. I'm a very convenient person. On off button, standard guitar cable output because it's really fun to use the lo fi phone with a guitar pedal. This is a lust pedal. When it comes to a microphone, it's all about the sounds you make, right? Lust, 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 lust. Also, link in to show you super straightforward when it comes to, to what the lo-fi phone is it's a lo-fi telephone microphone uh, so let's f go over to face master and yes to just show the chaos of us collaborating i guess and yeah testing a lot of things out with it like pushing the limits of it so let's let's, let's, uh, let's uneven weight, but it feels kind of good. Uh, yeah, I didn't please have... review it for me. Uh, yeah, it feels kind of good in your hand. I'm gonna figure it out. Uh, well, the first thing I notice is like if you press this button, there's a light. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, we got some kind of controller here. Don't know what it, uh, what it does, but uh, can, we, can we connect this? Um. 
<laughs> should, should I try this one? I yeah. feel like it. This feels like... Uh, I don't know what it feels like. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, okay, now how about it? Uh, oh, shit. Oh, pretty good. Okay. Annoying with... I'm going to try to do this. <laughs> <laughs> but do you feel like you figured out what it does? Uh, yeah, I think it's like uh, you get that old kind of feeling of the uh, telephone. But I'm, I guess like the um, guitar uh, amp is not a good example because it that enhances that kind of effect anyway. What you can actually do oh. that is kind of cool just based on like the design of a Cobra phone oh. is you can put it on the floor and record your amp with it. Like it's it's got a perfect height, at least for my oh. amp. Oh, jabla! Okay, <laughs> Did I just prank you? <laughs> it's not a bad idea to actually do that if we line in the amp. Yeah, exactly. So what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna try out. <laughs> we're gonna try a lot of different sounds with it. Oh, Cause yeah. they're all gonna be Filtered, I guess, in a sense, is what's happening with the telephone's yeah, exactly. sound effect. Yeah, yeah. It's like having a really sharp EQ type mm, exactly. thing. Yeah. So that's what we're gonna do. And we're gonna record it into we're we're gonna start a new music project and see if we can make like the telephone song. Mm? Okay, oh, that sounds cool. like a shitty jingle. <laughs> yeah, it's like specific frequencies are like really sharp in it. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Yeah. Try more sounds. Yeah. We, this, like, should we try yeah, yeah. record <laughs> bass with like through the amp? Oh yeah, yeah, let's do that. Cause that's uh, less hustle, right? I guess it's very hissy. Yeah. Pretty cool. Oh, nice. Yeah. Just cutting. Yeah, yeah, the perfect. Very high. perfect. I like this bass sound. Thank you. 
We need to wrap this up because it's becoming very, very hot, as you pointed out. Oh, uh, so I just wanna like conclusion. Conclusion. Yeah, pretty cool. Conclusion. Pretty cool, Mike. Buy it. <laughs> it's online. <laughs>